Tonight, we're learning more about a tragic shooting in Middleton. That shooting led to the deaths of two students. It happened Sunday night at an apartment on Maywood Avenue. Three people were found dead, and another man was shot multiple times. Officials say the man was shot as he exited the apartment. The two children who were killed were students at Sock Trail Elementary School. The school says their thoughts and prayers are with the friends and families impacted by this tragedy. Rachel Perry is live from the scene. And Rachel, we now know a little bit more about what happened that night. Yeah, guys, this is both an extremely sad and sensitive case. Middleton police now tell us the mother of the two young children shot and killed both of them before killing herself. Now, in the most recent update sent to us today, Middleton police captain Tyler Lather writes a 31 year old man was struck by gunfire multiple times as he exited the residence, adding an eight year old girl and five year old boy were shot and killed before the woman turned the gun on herself. We know the man is still in the hospital, but is out of the intensive care unit. Lather says the man is the father of the two children killed. At Middleton's common council meeting last night, several city officials spoke on the tragic incident. People are hurting. I had a person call me immediately today and was like, I'm, I'm glad to hear that you were knocking doors. I think I wasn't home, but I would love to talk to you. I would love to hear from the mayor of the city. My daughter's was playing in the front yard when this happened and I don't know what I don't I don't know what to do with them. So I said we're there for you. A vigil was scheduled for tonight, but has since been moved to Saturday. More on that coming up tonight at five. But for now, live in Middleton, Rachel Perry, 27 News.